one minute till launch now and uh, vehicles being put on internal power. Less than 30 seconds now until launch. Ground um, uh, the auto sequence has started and the ground umbilical for the uh, third stage and uh, tower have separated. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Uh, Progress 51 lifting off at uh, 5.12 a.m. Central Time from the Baikonur Cosmodrome in Kazakhstan. Everything going as planned. 40 seconds into today's launch. Soyuz has three stages. The first has uh, four liquid engines strapped to the side of the core vehicle. And each of those will burn for about a minute and 58 seconds before they're jettisoned. Everything continuing to look good as the uh, Progress 51 makes its way toward orbit. 70 seconds now into uh, today's flight of the vehicle. Continuing to see a good view of it here from the uh, launch pad in Bakanor where it launched just a moment ago and uh, now 100 seconds into uh, the flight and everything still looking nominal and uh, as planned. And we've just heard that uh, the first stage separation has been confirmed, 130 seconds into today's flight. The core of that first stage also serves as the second stage, which continues to burn until the uh, 4 minute and 58 second mark of the flight. Now 150 seconds into the uh, flight of Progress 51, everything continuing to look as planned. View here inside the uh, Russian flight control room in Korolev, Russia, just outside of Moscow, where the ground controllers there are watching over Progress's uh, flight towards the International Space Station. Everything continuing to go well as it makes its way into space. Second stage thrusters are performing nominally. You can see here at a breakdown of uh, the various phases of the uh, Progress's flight.
All still, all still going well as the progress makes its way into orbit. That flight takes about nine minutes. Uh, but it will take two days to reach the International Space Station, unlike it's, uh, the three previous progresses we've seen launch lately. The phasing and orbital mechanics of uh, today's launch date didn't allow for the single day launch docking that we've seen recently. So it will take again uh, the regular two days for this vehicle to reach the space station that is scheduled to uh, dock to the station at 7.26 a.m. Central Time on Friday. And the second stage separation of the vehicle has now been confirmed. The third stage uh, has a single engine that will burn for about four minutes and two seconds before shutting down at the nine minute mark of flight once it has, uh, once the progress has reached its orbit. All systems continuing to perform nominally as the progress makes its way into space. Just under six minutes now into the progress's flight. Everything continuing, continuing to work as planned. About two minutes left to go in uh, the Progress's flight to orbit, its preliminary orbit. And again, everything is continuing to work as planned, and all systems are looking good as it does make its way into space. Now more than eight minutes into its flight. All still looking well. Five hundred twenty seconds in uh, to today's flight, just a couple of seconds short of uh, the nine-minute mark at which it will be in space. And we just got confirmation that the third stage separation 
has occurred as planned and uh, vehicle has made its way into space successfully from the Bacchanor, Bacchanor Cosmodrome, which it launched from at 5.12 a.m. Central Time.